Welcome to another edition of Steppin' Outdoors. This is my favorite time of the year to be outside. The mornings are crisp and cool, and the elk are bugling in the distance. Today's show is all about wildlife viewing, with some tips and ideas on how to get close-up photos and footage of wild animals. So stay tuned. The best times to observe wildlife is usually early in the morning and early in the evening. One wildlife viewing tip is the PEQ rule. Be patient, be early, and be quiet. Well, I hadn't gone too far and I spotted this bull uh, there were some cows in the distance. I could hear them chirping. I couldn't see him, but I certainly saw him. Well, that was pretty cool. All it takes sometimes is getting up a little early and a little luck. Now you may need to sit for a few minutes or maybe even a couple hours to view wildlife, but be patient. You'll see them. When I came over this ridge, I couldn't believe it. There were bulls everywhere. I just stopped for a while and, and watched all the bulls run beside me and then I tried to keep up with them, just walking um, and kind of trotting beside them. And they, they didn't care that I was there. I'd run a little bit and, and catch my breath and they all seemed to be running from a bull kind of in the back. And so finally I caught up and I waited a little bit and this big old bull came out. He was really unique. He had three beams. I don't know if you can see it in the side there, but uh, he has another beam coming off his left main beam. And it almost looked like he walked with a limp, but it sure seemed like all the other bulls were running from him. He was awesome to see. Oh man, that was cool. There had to have been at least 10 bulls in there and they're all fighting for the cows and just bugling and bugling. They're still bugling back in the distance there. Now that's what it's all about.